Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I'm gonna do a random little video, but I really want to try press on nails. I have never ever worn press on nails. I did buy some from Kiss. If you hear crunching in the background, my kids are eating lunch like right in front of me. Um, I bought press on nails from Walmart by the brand Kiss the other day. And before I use those really pretty ones, I wanted to do a trial run of the ones from Dollar Tree. So I bought this glue from Dollar Tree. It is by Kiss. This was definitely a bust. Um, there's a packaging. So I don't know if it was just this one that is dried out or if it's all of them and that's why they're at Dollar Tree. But this glue was a bust. Luckily I have a backup. So we're not off to a great start. I actually put some press on nails on my daughter. And I just picked up these ones. Obviously they're a dollar. It comes with 12 nails. They're in short length and they're just these little mauve nude color and i'm just gonna try them because actually i have four days off from work so i'm gonna see how long these babies last i'm gonna put them on and then i'll be right back here's a little before shot of my nails i just realized that i don't have any earrings on that's so weird um okay so i put the nails on i wanted to show you guys what they look like They're actually not that bad, not that bad. I think I put this one too far down and it's like hurting my cuticle a little bit, but they're like square and they're kind of chunky. So I feel like if you have petite hands, these sizes will not work for you or you're gonna have to file them because these are kind of chunky. Um, they're more of like the 90s, early 2000s square where it's like a fat square, I guess, like that used to be in. And maybe I'm just used to like the coffin shape, so that's why they look really fat to me. But I like the color, they're just neutral, they're regular. Um, overall, for a dollar and you have a full set of nails, I think it's actually a really good deal. Like if you were in a rush and you had to go to an event and you had to look cute, I feel like this is definitely cute. And this will match anything. They have this, they have a clear oval, not clear, kind of like white oval. And they have another magenta pink. So those are the only three colors I found. I feel like this color, you know, if you have somewhere nice to go and you, you're in a pinch, like I said, and you don't want to wait for anything to dry, like these are really, really quick. This took me five minutes to put on and you, it was pretty easy. So it came with 12 and you just find what works best with your fingers. Um, I didn't want to handle them too much. I like file, I did a tiny little file on the sides, just like a once over, because they look really big, I feel like, but um, I didn't want to handle them too much because I felt like if I filed them too much, they might look crazy. Like, what if I didn't do a good job or something and I want to ruin them? So we're going to see how long these babies last. I have four days off of work. So... Hopefully these last the four days. And I used the Kiss nail glue that came in another Kiss kit. So the only thing is that hopefully next time I go to Dollar Tree and I get a nail glue, it's not dried up. And then if you have to only spend $2 for nails like once a week, I mean, it's way, way cheaper than going to the salon, way cheaper than press on nails from like Walmart. So I think it's a good deal. I'm excited to see how long they last. Just wanted to show you guys a close-up of the nails. I'm sorry my cuticles are so freaking crusty. I should have put some oil on or some lotion or something, but you know me, I'm not perfect. But yeah, you guys, I think they look really good for press-on nails. What's up, Rochicas? Just wanted to give you guys a little update on the nails. So it, I put them on yesterday. It's the next day. It's um about to be noon. They are growing on me i kind of like them they are kind of fat but i don't know now i'm kind of worried because I, I like this length i'm kind of worried about the longer ones that i bought and let me just show you guys just in case you didn't see these are the other ones i bought they're size long and these are size short so i'm a little bit worried about the length of these like they didn't look so bad at first but now wearing these I mean, these feel long to me because I always just cut my nails super short because of my job. So I don't know, but I really like this. Like literally for a dollar, this looks so good and like so nice and professional. Like 
I don't know. I really, really like them. Like, if I could have nails all the time, I'd literally just buy these. They're a dollar. I'd get them. Like, if this would be like the chill nail, like the everyday average nail, you know? I've already done dishes with them twice. Like, they are on there. So the directions, I forgot to tell you guys, on the little packaging of the nails, it said to put the glue on the nail and the glue also on your fingernail. So that's what I did. And then I was like, oh God, like these are really on there. Like they're really stuck. Like what if I can't get them off before I have to go to work? Cause I have only four days off. So yesterday was day one, today's day two. And then I have two more days and I have to go to work. So I have to take these off like the night before work, you know? Cause just in case I have trouble getting them off, like I need the day of work to finish up getting them off. And I'm like, you know, I may have stuck these babies on a little too well. And I'm really worried about getting them off before I go back to work. Cause this is definitely a dress code violation. And then I looked online and I was like, how long do glue on nails stay on? And they were like, about one to two weeks. And I was like, uh, um, yeah, because I only have four days. So it could be very painful and very bad to get these babies off. So stay tuned for that disaster. Also, I realized that by cutting the tip off of the nail glue with my kitchen scissors, I tried to use my kitchen scissors last night and I realized that they were super glued together. Don't know how I managed to do that, but now I have to buy a new pair of scissors, so fail. Um, but if you need nails that are like actually gonna last you a long time, this is definitely it. These babies are stuck. Like they feel like my nail. They feel like they are a part of me. I always thought that with glue on, press on nails that I'd be scared to touch anything because like one would pop off or something. But no, these, these feel more secure than acrylic nails. Like these babies are on. Hey bro chicas, back with an update. I skipped yesterday because nothing really changed with my nails, but today we have our first nail that came off. Now I was kind of like chewing on it, so I kind of helped it pop off, but regardless, like I can tell that a couple of them are starting to get loose. And since I go back to work tomorrow, uh, what time is it? 3.30. So it's 3.30 on a Sunday and I go to work at this time tomorrow. So I feel like I wanna start trying to take them off right now anyways, um, just to be sure that I'm all set to go to work because I cannot wear these. But overall, like, I feel like I could have got another day out of them if I didn't like mess with them as much. But um, even so I could like just glue the pinky back on if I needed to go somewhere if I was in a pinch The rest of them are pretty secure, but yeah, I'm going to try to like pop them off now The easiest way to take off your nails is to like use one of the nails that popped off and kind of like Get up underneath a Little lifted edge just a little tip for you guys um I do this when I have ever gotten acrylic nails. But yeah, um, another thing I wanna mention is that I thought my nails were gonna be like super damaged, but it doesn't look damaged at all. Like it looks completely fine. Like it looks healthier than when I've had acrylic nails on, that's for sure. Also, it was less days, but. Ooh, this one's really stuck. Ooh, this one's like really, really stuck. Another one down. It's kind of satisfying. Ow. Oh. Mm. All right, this hand is complete. They look a little bit fucked up, like a little bit. Oh wow, why is this so blurry? And this is what my natural nails look like after I took off all the press-on nails. Not too bad. 
Hey bro chicas, it's the next day and I realized I forgot to film an outro, but I just wanted to say overall, definitely think it is worth your dollar. I know it's like, what is what is spending a dollar, whatever, it's just one dollar buy them. But you know, a lot of people might say, oh, I wouldn't wear those cause they're cheapy or whatever. Like I would just rather spend money on ones that I know are gonna be good. I guess that's why I made this video because sometimes there's things that are worth even $1 and some, t some things are just not worth even just $1, you know what I mean? So I wanted to try them and see if it was worth it. They totally are. I would pay like $8 for those nails. They're very good nails. They're like the same quality as the ones that are uh, buy kiss and they're eight dollars in walmart or something totally worth it but they're a dollar so i'm actually gonna go back there and i'm gonna pick up a new nail glue i'm gonna exchange the dry one and i'm also going to uh pick up a couple more sets of those uh mauvey new nails that i had on because i want to keep them just for whenever i have some days off and i can have nails on i think it's great for me personally because yeah i could just paint my nails and then remove the nail polish on my days off but you know when you have a job where you can't have nails you miss it you really really miss it and i always keep my nails short and trim because of my job so i never get to have long nails so <laughs> excuse you so i'm definitely gonna go pick some up who knows how long dollar tree is gonna have those nails by kiss i know that dollar tree has their own version maybe i'll have to test out theirs as well but when i went the last time i didn't see them so yeah if you're looking for some really cute cheap nails definitely go check them out it's worth the dollar and this was a random little video but i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope it was helpful <laughs> and don't forget Bye. to like and subscribe to my channel. Bye. Bye.